GBC has to be there uh, in the same way as we support Gibraltar as a uh, nation side and we screen all of the national games. Uh, we thought it right that as we approached the group stage of a team uh, tournament that we also there because, you know, the fans are here in Gibraltar. They want to see the local lads. Uh, so we're going to be there for them. So we've uh, secured the rights, we've negotiated that over the last couple of weeks with UEFA and finally we've reached agreement during the weekend that allows us to screen the next six games of this uh, league. Now we've seen GVC move into football territory in the last couple of years with Gibraltar uh, joining UEFA, FIFA. Costly, uh, the broadcast rights for football and sports in general is costly, especially when it's run by international organisations such as UEFA and FIFA. So what support does GBC have for the payment of these uh, broadcast rights? Well, it is expensive, of course, negotiated so that it reflects also the size of the community. So it's not that we're paying the same as a large nation would. But still, GBC has uh, limited uh, funds uh, and uh, we've negotiated a price which is in keeping with what we can afford but nonetheless we'd dearly love to have the support of the business community as well so that we can continue doing this more often if need be uh, and uh, we do approach our regular sponsors to do so but we do rely on them as well so if you'd like to sponsor these games by all means call our sales department and we'll uh, be delighted to welcome you on board but yes, these are costly and also very, very highly complex uh, documents and highly complex negotiations uh, because there's a myriad of things that need to be looked into and a lot of specifics that UEFA ask for uh, and we need to take all of the boxes in order to be able to uh, screen them, uh, starting from graphics to the style of commentary to uh, loads of things uh, that come into the equation and all that needs to be rubber stamped before we get the broadcast rights and I'm glad to say that this weekend we achieved that.